Uh, it looked like there was no hope. Smudger had attacked the Midsodor manager in revenge for getting turned into a generator decades ago, and instantly <laughs> regretted his actions. Uh, what am I doing here? I went here? back to Bertram Station to repair the engines that were caught in the landslide, until I realised that we had a bigger monster on our hands. A red engine, by the name of Stanley, Smudger's rival back in the Midsodor railway has come back for revenge for being turned into a pumping engine for causing- He a has a accident. cigar in his mouth! He seems to have similar supernatural powers to Smudger. He has possessed all the engines Smudger once had control of and has also kidnapped Duke. I knew things could not end like this. I knew Smudger and Duke could make amends and Smudger could be redeemed. <laughs> but to do this, we had to save all the engines. I had to get Smudger back. I caught him trying to kill himself because he was in so much pain. But I managed to talk him out of it. After that, I signed up to be a night guard at a railway called Gerald's hometown, which is near Stanley's hideout. Doing this, I can keep the engines at bay while me and Smudger can save them one by one when the time is right. Oh my god. I know we can do this, although it's going to be very difficult. We have only one chance to put things right again. I have no idea what's going on. How's it going, Smellings? My name is Alex Diaz, and welcome to Five Nights at Smudger's 4, Engines at War. I already know you're about to go into the comments and be like, Bud, you're tired of FNAF. Why are you playing more FNAF, Bud? Shh. I've already explained my reasonings for playing FNAF games these days. Now, shush. Just a disclaimer, I have never played any of the Smudger's games. I know that there's uh, there's three, of course. It's the fourth game. But apparently, this game is a lot different compared to the first three. It's like FNAF mixed with Saving Private Ryan. Like, I'm sure a lot of you probably don't even know what movie I'm referencing. Pri Saving Private Ryan is like a really famous war movie. Uh, but yeah, I'm playing this, and I've heard a lot of weird and cool things about it. And we're going to play it. And yeah, it's a FNAF game, but honestly, I don't care because I'm interested in it and we're playing it right now. So we have achievements. Uh, hover your mouse over the achievement icons to see how to unlock them. Listen carefully to what the railway owner says at the end of the night one phone call. What? I have to listen? Oh, man. Wow, just break my eardrums. All right. Oh, what? This is like legit a war game, man. First shift. All right, here we go. Okay, go. Okay, I, I, this this is amazing. All right, all right, all right. Any any negativity I was gonna have toward this game is now shy. Welcome, speedsters. I am speed. That means I. What's wrong with you? Oh my god, this is really okay. I have no idea what's going on. All right, do I click this, or is that? A, oh, that, that must be a loading. Oh. Hello? Right. Hello, sir, are you there? Uh, yes, sir. Oh, yeah, sir. yeah, sorry, I'm here. What's up? A lot. Got a ton of stuff to do for this railway. How are you? Are you settling in well on your first night? Oh my god, that's oh, a freaking... I'm all right. just a bit... Uh, Wally -E reference. Sort. How so? Well, you know, weird stuff happens on these kind of jobs. You never know what you might encounter. Oh, don't be silly. The only things you'll see or even hear are just birds, wind, and, of course, the radio. I can hear it. Yeah, yeah it's bumping. I only have access to one radio station because of the signal. It ends at midnight. It's playing its last song now. That's a shame. They plan to build something around here that to fix that for you. So you'll be listening to the tunes all night and all sorts of news and conversations. Nice. Can't wait. So let's move on to what you have at your new place, shall we? For starters, sure. this is your office to do whatever you want. Of course, that's not illegal or whatnot. <laughs> then there's the CCTV system. You probably know how it works due to all the railways you've built. Just pull it up Camera and look around the, the cameras. Oh my there's God. also a TV behind you to look at what might be behind you if you're making a cup of tea or coffee or so. Like this? And of course, the window to look out the back. So for right now, that's pretty much it. There's something on your left we haven't installed yet, but I'll tell you about on that when it's done at a later time. Game. Okay, sure. Thanks, man. Now you look after yourself. Gotta do some more work, and we'll probably be awake as long as you are. So I'll speak with you later. Good night. Oh, wait, one, one more thing. Uh, the kids that visit here tend to leave their toys around the area, so keep a close eye out for them. What? If you do find any, just collect it for lost property in case they come back. Alright, that's it. Good night. Alright, mate. See you soon. Uh, oh, so yes. there is nothing to defend myself with. Wow. <laughs> Good job I bought this thing.
What? Wait. Okay, so, wait, okay, so can I, like... And that's all from us tonight. You've been listening to the Mainland FM radio station. Oh my god. Let's not the joke, shall we? What so is happening? So I walked past the park today, and there was a young woman and her baby chicken who was stuck in a tree. A man standing there asked me if I could climb up there and save them. He told me to be careful, though, because it's a tall tree and I might hurt myself if I fall. So I replied with, oh, I don't think so. I'm afraid the chicks are too high. Tune in tomorrow for another what? spectacular show. You know, me being a radio guy, I really appreciate that they've got, like, a late-night talk show on the radio right now, but what is happening? I am so confused. Like, what, if a, if a dude comes to the window, I got a fire? What am I monitoring right now? Hi, are you a threat? I don't know if you're a threat. I don't play FNAF hardly at all these days, so, like, I, I need to, like, get back into the groove. Because, like, the last, like, camera FNAF game that I played was, like, Treasure Island 2017 Remastered, and that was back in November. So, uh, I gotta get back into the groove here. I don't know what's going on. I'm sure dying a few times will help me get into the groove. I bet. Air sentry control to fire. So, we, we know the button for that, but, like, what do I fire at? And when? Alert. What is- Unauthorized personnel in sector yellow. What? 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 Dude. Uh. Uh. What do I do, man? I I'm guessing I just fire this. Maybe he'll appear in the window? Alert. Unauthorized personnel. Yeah, I know. Where? Hold on, all right, get, get ready to press control. We can't do anything about that. Oh, hello. Okay, we know you're there. Okay, you're there. Oh, hi. Ma what? Wait, wait, uh, mash to recharge, but mash what? Oh, I fired then. Okay, well, I'm, I'm, I'm screwed. What? What do I, oh, mash R! Okay, oh, I press space to turn around. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Press space to turn around behind me. Okay, that's cool. All right. Uh, am I dead or not? Because I'm confused. over music that's so unfitting game over but don't worry smudger used his powers to protect your body and keep you alive so get up and go avenge yourself Dirt. all right we back at it it's three o'clock again oh like we gotta make a uh gotta, okay make the reference oh we're halfway there there we go satisfying people who haven't heard that joke in a while anyways so i know now that of course don't fire the thing until it, the doors open like obviously man i don't know what you're freaking doing besides like my, my headphone cord was caught in something put down the camera my, my headphone cord was caught in something and it threw me off all right okay i know what i gotta do now okay yep he's outside all right but don't panic because we must press control when he opens the door ah! So we, we hit him. Are we good? Are we good? Got another guy here. All right. Ah! Not today, sir. Not today. I tell you, sir. Not today. Your boy is not dying today because his aim is on point. Imagine if there was like a, a first person shooter section here. That would be freaking amazing. Anyways. Yeah, we did it. I don't know why I didn't do that before. I don't know why my brain didn't... <laughs> what? Oh, it's five o'clock. That means it's almost time for breakfast. Yeah, give me all the bacon and eggs. Okay. So, what what about when, it, when things are behind me exactly? 
And also, I learned that like if you're looking behind you, you can see this, which means if you're dealing with something behind you, you can tell if somebody's there by looking at the TV, which is nice. I'm glad that that's a feature. But uh, yeah, okay, so we dive once. Oh, he's back. You ready to get shot in the base again, my boy? You ready? No! Ah! Get the freak out of here. Give me the bacon and eggs. I'm gonna be making the bacon and eggs as soon as it hits 6 a.m. I got the fryer ready, I got the pan ready, I got the real eggs, not the- Okay, I, I admit, I actually love this game right now. All right, well, we beat night one. I mean, I guess- Bro, this is so loud. All right, ooh, okay. Mission. Wanted Lori. Let's go. Is this night two or is this like an extra thing after? Okay. Mission one, runted Lori plot. Tim has tracked down his first target, Lori one, which has been possessed by Stanley. He must, it's kind of hard to read the spot. He must unpossess him by chasing him down and giving him a bump. Oh my God. Drive drive the truck with the WASD keys. Use your mouse to aim with the left and with, with the target. I can't read today and left click to shoot. Press the space bar to reload. Oh my God. Is there actually going to be an FPS section here? Are you serious? What is this game? Are you freaking serious? Alright, I left click the shoot. Alright, my aim Oi, on you! You are way over the speed limit. Stop! We'll be tasered. Alright, what do I shoot? Ah! Ah! Reload! What do I do? Hard to reload? What do I do to reload? Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, I'm about to lose. I don't, ah! Good. What? How, I've already forgot the button to reload. I think I think it's R. Yeah. I'm dead. Okay. 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 Ah! Ah! No! Oh. You, you are way over the speed limit. Stop, we'll be tasered. was gonna drop dang it i was ready for the beat to drop all right dude i love this i love this game i love this game i can see why people wanted me to play this this is actually really cool okay so what now oh be spike oh okay. is this night two is this night two or is this just more of night one hold on we're, we're gonna have to see but better close that mouth. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez, Rick. All right, here we go. All right, is this night two? Is this night two? Tell me this is night two. It I is night two. It. Okay. Go to camp 2C to see I the mechanic. Give that the voice cams are also headset added. That agents can Where use is 2C? To, you know, I can't tell what phones. 2C is. Then again, can he just use his powers he gained from the afterlife to call me? Well, speak of the devil, I guess. Oh, smudger or headset. Uh, All right. I was worried about you, mate. How's everything going? Yep, all good at the moment. I've seen where every engine is, where they're going. I'm going to start rescuing them soon. Just got to see what else Stanley is up to right now. Right, but more importantly, did you see any other engine or whatever heading towards my location? Yeah, it's scruffy. They all come back eventually, don't they? Anyway, I should let you know that different engines that are possessed, the instincts vary. For example, Scruffy, he's a coal truck, 
and he's a bit of a psycho. He isn't going to do what Proteus and Bertram do. For example, they try to sneak attack you, where Scruffy's going to try and rush in and do as much damage as possible. So the way to avoid this is just to avoid eye contact. You said your office is kind of dark, so he won't be able to see you straight away if you look behind you. So if you do look behind you, he'll leave. Simple. I'm okay. sure you can handle it, right? Maybe. Oh, of course I can. No problem. Yeah, of course, and thank you for making me choose the right path. I am forever grateful. You're I'm welcome. Back now, I don't know I what's going on. I'll see you soon. Alright then. Take it easy now. Okay, new mechanic. The laser sensor will be white, and if no one is inside the car park, if it's any other color, you must go to the console on the left and close the door on them. Is that what this is? Oh my god, what? This is the car park radar. Click the doors to close, like this. Okay, that means these are closed. Okay, so that uses power. Okay, so... I'm so confused. Okay, alright, can I close that? Okay. So... This laser sensor will be white if no one is inside the car park. If it's any other color, you must go to the console on the left and close the door on them. Okay. Okay, so if it's blue, that means there's a guy here? I'm so confused! <laughs> okay, we back at it. Now, yeah, okay, I figured out that... Okay, so we have three different colors. We got green, blue, and red. And so, it, so if this is like red, for example, we gotta go and uh, close the red door. But it uses power, so I guess we gotta quickly go and look and see, like, which... Um, I don't know what the other cams are used for, besides that one. So, yeah, if the laser is white, or if the, the bar there is white, that means that there's nobody there. But we gotta check this pretty consistently, so we gotta keep an eye on that. And also remember, the dudes at the door, we gotta shoot them in the face. As I've stated, I did not play the first three Smudgers games, so I don't really have any idea what's going on story-wise. But I do like this a lot. I love the way that it's being presented, like the fact that like there's a war going on, and like we're a we're, whoa. ah red. Okay. So there's somebody there, and as soon as it's white, okay, open that up. Doors open. Okay. So we gotta check that pretty consistently. Now he also mentioned something Alert. about unauthorized personnel in sector yellow. So I don't know who we need to... He mentioned, like, uh, somebody that we need to look away from. Oh, oh, okay, don't look at him. Aha! I did it. I did it. I'm pretty sure that's the guy I'm not supposed to look at. Yeah, because he left. Okay. Who was that? Who was that? Who was that? Okay, we're okay. We're okay. What time is it? Four still? Boom. Get out of my face. Alright, check, check, check. Okay, nobody there. Alright, I'm getting used to this. I'm kind of getting the hang of this. No, nope, not! Nah. Alright, see you later. I like how they make use of that TV. It's very convenient. I like it. Alright, 5 o'clock. We know it's 5 o'clock when the, when the chicken is like, oh, Keeps laughing at me. Whoever it is, he needs to stop. No, what, what is that? What is that? No, 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 no! Bruh. My game just crashed. That guy apparently crashes the game. Oh my god, I was like probably seconds away from winning. Alright, we back. I love dying at 5am. It's the greatest thing ever. Okay, that guy's quicker. He, he comes a lot quicker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, All right, we don't need to recharge right now. Check that. Oh, I knew it. Go, go, go. Oh, close that. Okay, we're good, we're good. Ah! Okay. Good, good, good. Okay. Okay. Now, yep. He crashes your game. I have learned that now. I didn't know what he did before, but he crashes your freaking game. Perfectly amazing. I was that close to winning before. That That's awesome. I was that close to winning. I just spent another 10 minutes redoing that, but it's okay because we won. It's fine. Uh, I hate dying at 5 a.m. in FNAF games. It freaking sucks, man. All right, what we got now? I'll do, I'll do one more mission. That's our next mission. Rigs back. 
This is gonna be a long episode, but it's fine because I love this game. Mission two, Big Rick's Battle. Blah, 10 mines have been planted in Tim's neighborhood by Lori too. You must find them, deactivate them all before the time runs out and unpossess him. Uh, avoid the other cars, press M here to view the map. Drive the truck with the WASD keys. Mini boss fight. When the mini boss is in view, arm hit, ram him and keep doing so to defeat him. Oh my god. Alright, I don't know what to do here, but we're gonna we're gonna figure it out. We're gonna figure it out together. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, okay, okay. Ah, whoa! I don't know what I have to do. Oh, I have to go. Oh my god. Alright, oh I have to go and like Okay, I have to deactivate all the mines. Okay, I have a time limit as well. Ah! Okay, I have to do that. All right, I'm out of, I'm running out of health. That's the problem. I don't know. This is so. Ah! Okay, okay. I'm not used to these kind of things in FNAF games, but it's fun. I like it. Well, well, look at my health right now. That didn't even hit me, but whatever. All right, here we go again. I got seven out of ten mines. All right, the other one's right there. Oh, ooh, that barely avoided that, dude. Dude, 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 dude. dude. Ah! So hard that I can hit my thing, man. Okay. Yeah. Dude, can I please get to that, dude? The, the, the hitbox is so weird. All right. Go back up. Oh, I'm almost out of health, but it's fine because where's the other one? Where, where's the other mine? Where's the other mine? I have one more. Where's the other mine? There it is. There it is. I got it. Woo! Oh my God. What? Back. what? Okay. What do I? What? Okay. Do I, it says I have to ram them. Okay, there we go. All right. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Dude, this is like the greatest thing ever. Okay. Okay, this isn't too bad. This isn't too bad. This isn't too bad. This is easy. This is easy. Ah. Dude. I'm, dude. Why? I'm pressing. I said this is easy and this happens. Don't, don't, don't get cocky, kids. Because you know what happens. All right. It's fine. I have plenty of health. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. Avoid it. Bam, bam. Oh, he almost dead. He dead. He almost dead. I love this. I freaking love this game. I, I actually love this freaking game. It's fine. Hit me all you want. I just have to hit you one more time and you're dead. Okay, get over here. Bam! Get the freak out of here, dude. The music goes away. Like, why couldn't they have kept playing the music, man? Maybe it's copyrighted. I bet that's why. Well, that's gonna do it for Five Nights at Smusher Spore Engines at War. I weirdly love this game. Like, I heard a lot about this, but I wasn't expecting it to be like this. I love this. Like, it doesn't even feel like FNAF, which is why I love it even more. Yeah, it's got, like, FNAF elements in it, but, like, things that... Look at what I just did. That is not FNAF. That is pure fun. I am definitely gonna come back to this game. For sure. I love this. And you guys know what to do if you want to see more. So, for now, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please smash that like button. Leave a like, subscribe to the channel, the Clan. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for my friends. Peace out. Bye-bye.